it's so difficult. Of, I mean, if I would meet Beethoven, what would I dare to, to say to him or to ask him? Being music director of Mostly Mozart is, of course, very different. Uh, compared to the Cincinnati Symphony Orchestra uh, because the Cincinnati Symphony Orchestra is a 52 weeks orchestra and here in the festival for five weeks we join again together but I must say it's quite astonishing to see that year after year even after a gap of almost 11 months we always start higher and there is really a very strong musical and artistic identity. Of course, a festival is, has to be exceptional moments. So, so the vibe is different. And uh, actually, I enjoy both of my job because they are complementary. first the masterpieces I'm immersed in and of course I have the privilege to be able to choose which one I want to to conduct and also the joy of sharing these pieces first with the musicians during the rehearsals and then for the concert in a much larger uh, community a conductor is by definition the musician on, on stage being the only one who doesn't produce any sound. So of course you have to share, you have to bring together the energy and also the, the language. Quite often young conductors come to me and ask, so how should I do to make a musical career? There is no perfect answer for that. There is no path and to be sure that it will work. I think the most important thing is to do what we are doing with as much intensity and integrity as we can, serving the composers and um, trusting the musicians you work with. It's so difficult. Of, I mean, if I would meet Beethoven, what would I dare to, to say to him or to ask him? If I would meet Leonard Bernstein, I mean, of course I would have zillions of questions, but I would probably be too intimidated. If I would meet Mozart, no, I know. If I would meet Mozart, I would bring my completion of his C minor mass and uh, ask him for corrections. One of my most extraordinary moments by conducting, was not on stage, it was in the pit, conducting Don Giovanni in Dresden, Germany. The day before, I went for the first time of my life in a Rolling Stones rock concert. It was mesmerizing. It was a fantastic experience. So the, the day after, I, mean, I conduct Don Giovanni, at the end of the overture, my baton was broken. And I always have a spare baton. So at the end of the first scene, my second baton, and I didn't do anything special. I was probably in such a high adrenaline uh, state of being that I had to finish the opera with bare hands. And that was quite a memorable experience.